ladies and gentlemen, it is great to be back here on the road to WWE 2D19, and wait a minute, of who are don't we want starting off cool. this tournament with, who is it? You know what cool is? Who is starting off? Oh, <laughs> look at that! Carlito! The following contest is good for one forward as a round four qualifier. And it is first from seven, four, three, go wing at 220 pounds. Carlito! Carlito, former United States, former Anaconda champion. You know, I, I've been so out of the loop with this. I forgot who was in round number four and who was competing against each other. But you know what? They, they People up at the higher ranks said, you know what? Just because you're behind and all that, we're leaving it all a mystery. And you can't talk during the beginning part like you usually do. Just the beginning graphics with the music playing for a little bit. And then, you know, it. Man, it's tough, it's tough, but you know what, I feel like I'm a swallow, so, anyways, Carlito is in the ring, and, well, who's his opponent, I gotta, I gotta wonder, I'm wondering who his opponent is, I'm about to find it, wait a minute, wait a minute, this is who I think it is? <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. His opponent from Joanna Castillo, New Mexico, weighing in at 174 pounds, Grand Metalik. Hey, you know, so just say he's from Mexico, okay? Just don't. You can't pronounce the name. Don't make an ass out of yourself, okay? But Grand Metalik versus Carlito. This is gonna be interesting. Two men of similar wrestling styles. High flying is not out of their arsenal. Ground game is not out of their arsenal. Two very, in my opinion, similar. Similar athletes. Can I get a hint on what the next match is? No. Anyways, here we go. Carlito, Graham at Elite. Here we go. We are back. Graham at Elite starting off right away. Uh, back suplex. Oh god! Back suplex driver. Metal League would be looking for the Metal League driver. Carlito would be looking for that wicked back stabber. Carlito with the arm wrench. Oh, Grand Metal League and a leg drop to follow by Carlito. Carlito with the, oh, Grand Metal League with the kick to the head. And a head scissors by Grand Metal League early on in this match. Metal League seems to be control. I'd like to keep that control and make it to the Sweet 16. Oh, you bomb by Grand Metalik. Missed the stomp. Grand Metalik, of course, made it to the finals for the Cruiserweight Classic. He would love to make it to the finals and win this tournament. But there's some other people out there who are more determined to win this. Oh, but Carlito is one of them with a reverse DDT. There's only 16 men that will be left after these 30 or 16 matches are over, actually. 16 matches to qualify 16 people. And from there, knee lift by Carlito. From there, the tournament will commence and conclude. As you guys remember, um, there is a WWE 2K19 midnight release stream on October 5th on YouTube. Here, of course, where you're watching from. On October 4th, the final episode for the tournament will be released. And from there, we'll know who won, who is the best in WWE 2K18. Grabbing the league, though, with a punch to the gut. Carlito with a fireman's carry. Both of these men would love to be in that position to become the WWE 2K18 champion. Carlito now. Snap suplex, and Carlito floats over. Cover one. No kick out of one by Grabbing the league. Both of these men aren't gonna, not going to get up so easily, but if Carlito hits the backstabber, it might be all over with. Backstabber by Carlito. That might do it for Grabbing the league one. Two, no, Metal League kicks out. It's that heart of determination of Grand Metal League that allowed him to be in the finals of the Cruiserweight Classic. Missed the moon, so Carlito did. And that might be the opening for Grand Metal League. If he can get him up, he's got him on the shoulders. And there's the Metal League driver. One, two, no, Carlito kicks out a two. Metal League can't believe it. He's got to use the ropes to his advantage. He's the king of the ropes. Going to the second rope, listening to my advice for one. See, I'm a good coach. I'm a good coach, all right? 
not just the best interviewer in the NWS Revolution, but the best commentator in the NWS as Grandma the League is in control of Carlino now. Up on the shoulders. Oh, wait a minute. Metal League Driver again? Oh, God. Head first. Neck first. No protection there. Oh, man, I could have made that worse. There was no turmoil pad there. Going for a suplex. Carlito counters into a suplex of his own. Carlito needs to get back into this match. But he needs to get back quickly. Will that do it? I don't think that's going to... One. Nope. See, I don't think Ramon Lee is going to go down to a simple suplex. No. Mercer went down to a stomp last year, but that's Mercer. Oh, Metalik. Looks like he's going to be using my vice once again. The king of the ropes. What a beautiful arm drive by Grand Metalik. Metalik. Hyping himself up, hyping the crowd up. Could have signaled for, uh oh. He could be going for another Metal League driver. Will Grand Metal League be in the final 16 of this tournament? Up on the shoulders. Metal League driver. That's gotta be it. No one kicks out of two Metal League drivers. No, Carlito just did. He did it like it was no problem. Metal League has gotta be beside himself. He's gotta stay on Carlito though. He's gotta stay on him. And I think he's doing just that, but Metal League allowed Carlito. Oh, maybe not. I was about to say he allowed uh, Carlito have breathing room. No, he's not. Metal League is doing what he did to the Cruiserweight Classic. And that's what got him this far. That's what got him to the final two of the Cruiserweight Classic. But Carlito, the first DDT. He's a cunning athlete. Fox splash by Carlito. Twisting him in. And that might do it. One. Two. No. Grandma Metal League kicks out a two. Carlito's got to stay on Grandma Metal League. Another one dropped by Grandma Metal League. Metal League control. No, Carlito with a punch of the gut. One of these two men have got to do something. I do it quickly. I think, I think Metal League sensed that Hurricane Rana. He sensed that Carlito was going to go for that backstabber. He was not going to allow him to do that. Kick in the back by Metal League. Bit of a... I shouldn't say backstabber of his own, but... Sling Blade by Grand Metal League. Metal League is staying on top of Carlito, but Carlito is fighting back. Here now has got Metal League. Up against the ropes. What's he going to do here? Oh... What are they doing here? Coming him down. Oh, and a knee right to the sternum of Grand Metal League. Missed the stomp, Carlito did. Why did you just punch him in the face? Hurricane run by Grand Metal League. Got him! That one mistake might have cost Carlito in the long run. Metal League now. Maybe not, Carlito with an elbow. Job breaker by Metal League. These two men are going back and forth for counters. What the hell was that? He might have misdirected the moonsault. Carlito now going for a suplex of some sort. Oh, brain buster by Carlito to the top rope. Frog splash. But he's not done from there. He's not done with Grand Metal League. And a DDT by Carlito. That missed moonsault attempt might have cost Grand Metal League everything in this tournament. And Carlito now back. Stabber, one, it's again, here's the cover, one, two, no, Metal League is still in this fight. But Carlito, oh, working the arm, that's smart. Weaken your arms, you weaken his chances of hitting the Metal League driver. Carlito needs to avoid that, maybe going for another Brain Buster once again, and he does Brain Buster right on the top of his head. Oh, Metal League's, Metal League's midsection has got to be hurt. Carlito go to the top rope. Just end this already. Frog splash again. That's it. One. Two. No. I, I'm the same way as Carlito. How the hell did Grand Metal League kick out of another frog splash? No, Metal League's not giving up. Jaw breaker by Grand Metal League. Look at this. Spanish fly. Metal League, where did he get this from? Metal League now. Up on the shoulders, Carlito is a third Metal League driver. Hook of the leg. One, two, no. Oh my God, was that it for Grand Metal League? No, no it wasn't. He's got to go for one more. He's got one more ready. He's going to do what he needs to do. And a fourth Metal League driver. Hook of the leg. One, two, no! Oh my 
God, what a fight by these two men. Shoulder block by Corleo. These two men, no one's on the line. And Corleo could be one more backstabber away. That might have been everything Graham and Malik could give. Backstabber again. Madalik is out. One, two. No! You have got to be kidding me. How in the hell? Uppercut by Madalik. It's gonna come down. Oh, power bomb by Corleto. It's gonna come down to the next big move. It has to. It has to. Each man, I think it's delivered four of their signature moves. And it hasn't put them away yet. Metal League going for one more time. Carlito just pushes them off. And a Russian life sweep by Carlito. Oh my god, I'm out of breath just out of this first match. I'm gonna lose my voice, but even this Hurricane Rana by Carlito. Metal League's ribs have got to be killing him now. My god. Oh, Carlito, just disrespect. Oh, no, this is it. If Metal League can't counter this, then this is going to be it for Grand Metal League. Another backstabber! One, two, Carlito advances. I spit in the face of people who don't want to be cool. Oh, my God. You know what cool is? You're looking at Nothing beats me. And I spit in the face of people who don't want to be cool. Killers in this tournament. I tried to be a nice guy. Full of a contest is a round five qualifier scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Weighing in at 230 pounds. Owen Hart. Owen Hart. Part of the late and great Hart Foundation. I can say late and great because both not all of them passed unfortunately. Rest in peace to give me a von Nightheart. But I mean, I say you're slightly off by one pound, but dude, that's all right. Owen Hart now, who is his opponent? I've been told that this match is a big one, a very big one. But I, I can't be told any hints apparently. It's not my fault I took it in the job as well. Jeez. But Owen Hart has a big opponent here tonight. We'll what to find out who it is. Who is who is Owen Hart's opponent? No. No way. Oh my god. Is he really? Oh my god! His opponent from Calgary up for the Canada wing at 235 pounds. Brett, the Hitman Hart. Brett Hart, Owen Hart, a WrestleMania rematch. WrestleMania 10. They opened up the show and they stole the show. 
Bret Hart on that night went to become the WWF Champion by beating Yokozuna one year after he lost the title to Yokozuna at WrestleMania 9. Bret Hart has gone on to feud with Owen Hart since then. I believe they had a steel cage match at that year's SummerSlam with the WWF title, if I'm not mistaken. I believe, I believe I'm right on that. I'm 99% sure. Owen Hart, Bret Hart, I believe this might be the tiebreaker as well. Here we go. This is, uh, I, I, I got goosebumps for this. Neckbreaker by Owen Hart. Missed the stomp. Now this is going to come down to who can lock in the sharpshooter first. Who can lock in that sharpshooter first and who can lock it in the tightest. That's what it's going to come down to. Owen Hart now. Oh no, Bret Hart. I spoke soon. Sorry. Bret Hart counted Owen Hart. Up a cup I brought the Hitman Hart. Oh, I can't believe this match is happening. I'm excited. Bret Hart now. Backbreaker. Vintage Bret Hart. Bret Hart now stepping away on Owen Hart. Elbow by Bret Hart. Bret Hart now. Irish whip. Going for something. No, Owen Hart counters. Ooh, caught to the back by Owen Hart. Missed the clothesline. Bret Hart now picking Owen up. Yeah, go for something. Kick to the gut. Can we DDT by Bret Hart? Who is going to get the upper hand first? Bret Hart now. Could be going for a pile driver, perhaps. Pile driver by Bret Hart. Stepping on the face of Owen. Not for something here, but Owen. Oh! That's smart by Owen. He's going after the legs first. I don't know how smart it is going after the arms, but you know what? I More power to him. Owen Hart still in control here. I have a whip. Spinning heel kick by Owen Hart. Owen now could be setting Brett up for something. What's he going to go for here? Wait a minute. Could be going for a tombstone power driver. Connecting on Owen Hart. On oh, Brett Hart. Sorry. Ugh. Why did I get them confused? <laughs> Bret Hart avoids that. Bret Hart now in trouble. Rolls through. Flips over. Arm drag by Bret Hart. These two men know each other so, so well. Owen now looking for a suplex. Got Bret up in the suplex by Owen Hart. Owen is confident. He should be right now. He's got his older brother Bret down. Owen now, he's got to do something. Cut to the back. But Brett avoids it. Cut to the back by Brett. Are we going for a back suplex perhaps? Yes, Brett connects. Missed the stomp. Missed the kick. Kick got by Owen. Backbreaker of his own by Owen Hart. See, Owen has learned so much from his older brother Brett. That he's able to hopefully counter everything. Owen! There's Sharpshooter! Owen with the Sharpshooter! Will this be an alright one? Bret Hart tap onto the Sharpshooter! No, of course not. Bret Hart has his ways out of it. Bret Hart, the master of the Sharpshooter. Owen ends the guard by Bret! Stomping away now. Stomping in the back. And going right for the hands. Both of these men have done almost the exact same things the other one has done. Sleeper slam there by o Bret Hart. Hulk in the leg by Brett. One. No. Kick out at one by Owen. Was he going to put away Owen? Oh. Punch the gut by Owen. By Bert. Oh. Maybe that tube's on. No. Brett Hart. Neck breaker by Brett Hart. Brett. Dude. Come on, man. You're the older brother. You're supposed to be smarter than that. Why would you turn your back on your little brother Owen? That's not going to end well for you. See, Owen rolls out. Four, see, Brett, that's what you get. Got a little bit cocky. Light drop by Owen Hart. And a knee to the back by Owen. Owen seems to have gotten the better of his older brother, Brett. Or maybe not. Maybe not. Can I lock it? Sharpshooter by Brett. Can Brett make his younger brother, Owen, tap out in advance of the Sweet 16? Nope, because if Brett has got a sword, it's Owen! Owen got out of it. Punch. Missed the kick. Enziguri by Owen Hart! Trademark of it is the Enziguri. Now Owen. Wait a minute. Owen might be looking for another sharpshooter. He's got to have a better situation this time than he did last time. 
He's got it! Can he make his older brother Bret tap out? What bragging rights would that be if Bret Hart tapped out to Owen Hart? But that's not going to happen as Bret gets out of it again. Missed the club and Owen with a slug of a shot. Owen now ready for another tombstone and connects. Oh, my voice is cracking up. I blame that last match for making my voice crack up. But Bret answers with a power driver of his own. These two men are going back and forth with the same maneuvers. One, two, no, Owen kicks out. How sweet would it be for Brett or Owen to make their own brother tap out? You gotta you got think that'd be bragging rights. Brett setting out the sharpshooter, trips the leg. Stops over, sharpshooter applied again. Will Owen tap out? Will Brett prove why he's the best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be? Oh, he's got that tight. He's got that tight. Owen taps out. Owen Hart taps out, and Bret Hart advances. What a match. What a WrestleMania rematch. Bret gets revenge from WrestleMania 10. Power driver by Bret Hart early on in the match. I think Owen had that receipt right there with that tombstone power driver. This might have been the second one that Owen Hart delivered. And then Bret, there's the receipt right there with the power driver of his own. And then Brett had that second sharpshooter of his locked it deep, deep enough to where Owen had no choice but to tap out. Doesn't come out the power driver, but Brett, no, no sweat for Brett. Brett would lock in the sharpshooter. Brett Hart takes up the victory. The winner of the match, Brett the Hitman Hart. Brett Hart wins this WrestleMania 10 rematch and is in the Sweet 16 with Carlito. There will be two more names confirmed in this video. Who will go on to round number five, the Sweet 16? So far we know Carlito and Bret Hart. We have two more names to find out in this video. Don't go anywhere, we'll be right back after this quick commercial break. Alright guys, so we are back here for the third match of the evening. Oh, oh god. Whoever this guy's opponent is, can you please beat him? I don't want him advancing any more than what he already has. He's in, he's in the final 32. And I don't want him to go to the Sweet 16. But, nonetheless, Legend Tatsu Fujinami, I think the ring announcer, um, might want to introduce him. <laughs> the following contest is a round five qualifier schedule for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Japan, weighing in the 227 pounds, Tatsumi Fujinami. Tatsumi Fujinami, a legend of the wrestling industry. You know, I, I don't mean disrespect, I understand he's a legend and all respect to him when it comes to what he's done in the business, but I don't want him advancing anymore. Who's his opponent? Wait a minute. I don't think he does this entrance anymore. But I think I know who this is. And if it is him, then I want him to beat him. I want him to beat Tatsu Fujinami. Oh, ho, 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 ho. His opponent from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, weighing in at 202 pounds. He is the current. Impact Wrestling World Champion Austin Aries. This has been interesting. Austin Aries left the WWE a while back last year. Has made something of his career once again back in Impact Wrestling. A three time World Heavyweight Champion. Now I gotta stay with Killer Cross and Moose. Aries. I gotta give Aries the advantage here. A gifted ring veteran. And quite simply, the greatest man that ever lived. Alright, we'll see what happens. Tatsumi Fujinami. Austin Aries. 
Who's going to be the third person in the Sweet 16? Here we go. Matchup underway. Kicked the gut by Tatsumi. Oh, God. Five face lock. Tatsumi. Oh, man. Beautiful judo throw. Tatsumi's in control right now. Aries got to use that quickness, man. Oh, what? He went over Tatsumi. <laughs> Not in the way that I would want him to go over Tatsumi. But Tatsumi Fujinami so far, this has been all Tatsumi. Aries just can't seem to get control of Tatsumi Fujinami here tonight. I don't understand why. Oh, God. Tatsumi Fujinami in control right now. Stamming away. Oh, God. Tatsumi Fujinami. Look at the power. Look at the power and the strength of Tatsumi Fujinami. Oh, my God, dude. Christ almighty. This is... This is a... This is not going good for Austin Aries right now. But he's avoided that chop pretty damn well. But neck break by Austin Aries. Aries now stomping away on Tatsumi Fujinami. He picks him up. Sends him up. Picks him up now. Right. Oh, knee to the gut by Tatsumi Fujinami. For a backbreaker. Oh, God, backbreaker. And Tatsumi doesn't go for that knee pads or elbow pad shit. He goes... He, he's old school right like that. Oh, missile drop kick there by Tatsumi Fujinami. I'm a little bit surprised, I won't, I won't lie. I'm a little bit surprised. What about the hell? Wait a minute, roll up of some sorts. Look at this bridge. Two. Oh, no. That was that was unique there by Tatsumi Fujinami. I will not lie. I'll, I'll give him credit where it's due, but I hope he doesn't win. Yes, if you heard that, this year is very spooky. But maybe he didn't. I don't know. Uppercut by Ares. Irish whip by Austin Aries. Drop kick! And Aries is in control. Missed the kick to the back though. Tatsumi Fujinami now. Uh oh. Shin breaker on the way. Right to the leg of Austin Aries. Tatsumi taunting for the crowd. He's been in control this whole match on Austin Aries. That's the club. Fireman's carried by Tatsumi Fujinami. Got him by the head now. What are you gonna do here? What are you doing? the hell are you trying to do? But well, he counted again with another five minutes carry. Yes, he knew that plan wasn't going to work. Uh oh, German. Oh, God. German suplex on Austin Aries. Come on, Aries. Fight back. Y yes. Hurricane. Come on, Aries. Come on, Aries. Put him away. Put him away quick. Do it. Nice. Michinoku driver by Austin Aries. Come on, Austin. You got to keep on him, man. You're doing more than just that. Front face lock. There you go. Nice. Beautiful Hurricane Rada by Austin Aries. Come on, Aries. Put put him away. Oh, he's got him up on the... Oof. That was unique by Austin Aries. Not sure what the hell that was. Um, Austin, what are you doing just standing around there? You might be setting up for something. Oh, club to the back. Shot at the ribs. Oh, no, 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 Tatsumi, no. Oh, God. Shot to the chest of Austin Aries. Come on, Austin. You can't. No. No, 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 Dragon. No. Aries. Aries, get out of this. Aries, quick. Quick, 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 get out of this. Oh, oh, God. That's deep. That's deep in. No, 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 Tatsumi. No. Oh, phew. Thank God. No! No! Not again! No! 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 Aries, get it! Okay, phew. Thank God. Okay. Okay, phew. Okay, Aries, don't scare me like that. Jeez. Tatsumi's known for that deadly dragon sleeper, man. That's not good. If you get locked in that. Oh no! 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 Oh God! Snap suplex on the way. Come on! Yes! Get out of it. Yes. <gasps> Brain Buster. Brain Buster on the way. Come on. Yes. Get him. Pin him. That's it. That's it. Aries, you got this. Come on. Ref, get over there. Oh, what? That's bullshit, Ref. Get. Ah, oh, I knew it. I knew that one going to go well as soon as the ref took forever to get over there. Come on, Aries. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Let's see. Well, I assume he's getting up. Oh, yes. Come on. Come on, Aries. Come on, Aries. Yes! Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. 
Yes! There you go, Ares. Come on. Yes. 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 Yes! There you go. There you go. Yes. Ref, get... Okay, that was faster. One. Two. Fucking... God. No. Ares, one more time. One more time. Come on. Or... Second rope? Okay. Okay, maybe he's got a plan. Maybe he's got a bit of a plan. Okay. I, 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 it's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. No, it's not. Everything's not fine. This is not okay. No, this is really not okay. This is really not okay. No, get out of this. No, dragon suplex. No, 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 Ares. Get out of this, Ares. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh my God, that's scary. Oh, Jesus, Ares. That's who he's in control, though. Picking, picking up Austin Aries. Come on, Aries, get out of this. Yes. Yet, yeah, no. Fuck, Aries. Come on. Oh no, is it? You put him on the top rope. That's not good. Oh, yes, yes, yes. This is good. Oh, nice. Neck breaker for the top of my Austin Aries. Oh, come on. Yes. Yes. Come on, Aries. I don't know what you're gonna go for. Maybe that discus. Oh, God, what a clothesline, Mario Scenaries. What are you doing? Oh, wait, submission. Submission old. I think that's a... Isn't that the Celtic Knot or something? Or like an Indian Deathlock, I believe? Yeah, it's one of those two. It's pretty effective. Oh, yes, yes. If every sister's brain buster, it'll be all over with. And Aries will advance the next round. Come on, get him up. Yes, drop, yes. Pin him, pin him. Power by Aries. One. Two. Yes! Austin Aries advances. Tatsumi Fujinami is out. Woo! That's Brain Buster number one, I believe, by Austin Aries. It's like a bit. It is number two. Tatsumi Fujinami gave a hell of a fight. He almost picked up the win. This dragon suit fight is oh, always beautiful to see, though. And then that clothesline, head clean off. And then a third brain buster was just enough to put away. It's gonna be all of him inside Tsubi Fujinami. No, we're not on the map. Austin Aries! Aries is man number three in the Sweet 16. Aries is confident. And he should. He's on his way to getting another belt. For his belt collection. The Impact Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion has advanced. Who will advance in the final match of the evening? Who will advance in match number four? Well, um, I don't even know who's in match four, so I'm gonna find out who's in match. And thank you guys all. So, we will see you right then. Alright guys, it is time for our main event in the evening. Oh! Uh oh! We might have a squash in our hands. Here comes the ultimate warrior, LG! Bring it out to you, I'm gonna hurry! Follow the counters around by Clarify, get the one for introduce you first, from Port Town now, weighing in the 210 red pounds! The ultimate warrior! <laughs> ultimate warrior, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, he's absolutely dominated Xavier Wood. And I believe the last round? I want to say it was the last round. Or maybe the round before. I don't know. But Ultimate Warrior is a wrecking machine. But who will he face? Will he face someone who he could defeat easily? Or, or, is he going to have more of a challenge? Ultimate Warrior, you got to think he's one of the favorites in my view. Who's his opponent? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh-oh, wait a minute. Wait, which one is this? Which one is it then? Did it both of them make it? Hold on. What the list? I think this is Jimmy. I want to say this is Jimmy Uso. But... 
Yeah, 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 Jimmy Uso! Jimmy Uso, one half of the five time SmackDown, or WWE, I should say. Tag Team Champions, the Usos. One of the most decorated tag teams in recent memory. Excuse me, one second, I'm gonna get a drink. Ultimate Warrior, Jimmy Uso! Here we go. Matchup on the way. Jimmy Uso has got to be careful. Oh, God. Warrior is very quick when it comes to capitalizing off that military press slam. And if Warrior is able to pull that off pretty fast, then Uso is going to have some trouble. Oh, God. Warrior dominating Jimmy Uso on the get-go. Oh, God. Going for another power slam, perhaps. Oh, man. Ultimate Warrior is just dominating Jimmy Uso right now. Perfectly in control right now. Uso needs to get out of this. Oh, God. Warrior. Like, like I said, the Ultimate Warrior is one of my picks to win this whole thing. You might become... Oh, wait. Jimmy. Jimmy, you need to, you need to not screw up like that. That's not going to help. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Jimmy, you need to get out of this. Get out of it. Get out of it. There you go. I'm not... I, I, I have no problem with Ultimate Warrior, by the way. <laughs> I'm... I'm... I don't want a squash. <laughs> is all I don't want. There you go, Uso. Uso's in control right now. The warrior. If he can keep, if he can keep this up, then Jimmy Uso might eliminate the Ultimate Warrior. Soup. Oh no! Oh no, Uso! No! Uh oh, Warrior. Oh god, he counted a super kick. Warrior counted a super kick. That's not good for. That's not good. That is not good for any. One that uses a super kick. Snap suplex by the Ultimate Warrior. Warrior is taking control of this match in a hurry. Like, he is not messing. Oh, Uso. Uso is standing his ground, though. But Warrior, my God. Ultimate Warrior, big counter. Oh, God, knees in the head by the Ultimate Warrior. Warrior still in control. Oh, no, 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 no. Military press. Okay, no, it's not the one. That's not the one that he usually does. Does. da 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 Dude's does. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, splash. Oh, shit. That caught me off guard. One. Two. Oh, Jimmy kicked out. Oh, boy. That almost was it right there. I, I got thrown off guard. Now, I'm going to be honest. I got thrown off guard right there. I thought Usa was done for. Oh, God. He needs, to, he needs to hurry. He needs to mount something. Russian leg sweep there by Jimmy Uso. Uso, you need to do something quick. I mean, quick. No, no! Warrior with that reverse game on point! Save right there! Warrior's just taking it to Jimmy Uso! Right, for a side slam. Oh, God! Oh, my God! Ultimate Warrior is taking it. Oh, no, but Uso needs to have his game on point, too! Oh, see, there you go! You have to do what you gotta do. What you gotta do. I don't really disagree with that. Jimmy Uso in control of Ultimate Warrior. You need to stay on him. You need to get that super kick quick while he's down, while he's gassed. Will Jimmy Uso... Wait, no. No, he's not. Wait a minute. Shades of his father, Rikishi. Rikishi driver. I think Rikishi's doing this. Yes. He's got to go to the top. Uso splash. Cover him. What are you doing? Pin him. There it is. Cover. One. Two. Oh, Ultimate Warrior kicks out. But Jimmy needs to keep doing that. He's got to stay on Ultimate Warrior. If he can keep doing that, he will he will do the unthinkable in my view. I, I, I don't I don't even know if it's possible to eliminate the Ultimate Warrior. Oh, but Jimmy Uso, he's kind of catching Ultimate Warrior's reverse game a little bit. And matching up with him with that. And that's a really smart thing for Jimmy Uso to do. If he wants to take out the Ultimate Warrior, he's got to keep up with that reversal game. Because Warrior has been able to reverse just about almost everything, except for this little onslaught recently. Well, until now, I spoke a little too soon. Warrior back in control again. Ultimate Warrior now. Oh, God. 
knee drop there by the ultimate warrior. Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no, 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 again. Warrior splash. Oh, no. That's not good for Jimmy Uso. Ultimate warrior on the cover. One. Two. No, Uso takes out. Jimmy Uso is still in this match. Uso putting out that fighting spirit. Warrior's got to keep digging down deep, man. He's got it. He's got to go to the vein to the ultimate warrior. But see, Jimmy Uso is keeping up with Warrior when it comes to the reversal game. He's been doing real good when it comes to it. See, like that. Oh, but Warrior. Warrior not afraid to match up with them when it comes to reversals. Uh-oh. But see, Jimmy Uso is keeping up with that reversal game. And that's really, 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 really smart. Back suplex by Jimmy Uso. Getting himself psyched up. Getting the crowd pumped up. Submission hold. Oh, this is smart. This is smart. If he can make Warrior tap out. He's been working on the back in the midsection of the Ultimate Warrior. Oh, nope. Warrior got out of it. Jimmy, you're going to need to do something. Put him in the corner. Take that. No. Warrior, see? No. Nope. See? Jimmy Uso. Jimmy Uso is competing with Ultimate Warrior when it comes to that reversal game. Snap suplex by Jimmy Uso. Go to the. He's going to the top. Uso splash again. Can Jimmy Uso do it? Pin him. What are you doing? Hook in the leg. Ah, uh, ref wasting time. One. Two. Oh, so close. But yet so far. Oh, Uso's not done. Uso is not done. Another one. Two in a row. Two. Uso splashes in a row. Hug in the leg. One. Two. No, oh, my God. I cannot believe it. The spirit of the Ultimate Warrior is still running while still there. Oh, but, oh, Warrior with a clothesline. Oh, Warrior's not playing around anymore. He needs to put away Uso. He needs to do it fast. Oh, no, military press. Oh, no, he's got him up. Down he goes. And that usually follows. By that might have been an error. That might have been a mistake, but maybe not side slam. Why didn't Warrior go for the ultimate splash right away? Why is he not going for the ultimate splash? This is gonna, this might cost Warrior. Oh, I don't think he's he is pissed. He's pissed. He's pissed that he hasn't been able to put away Jimmy Uso. Oh, but his anger is gonna cost him. His anger is gonna cost him super. No, maybe not. Warrior, you need to put him away. If you're gonna put him away, you need to do it quick. Warrior's pissed. Wait, what? Why are you not going for? I don't understand. What is Warrior's game plan here? Picks up Jimmy Uso. Oh, but Jimmy Uso's not going to allow... Oh, no, but Warrior. Russian likes we've countered. What is his game plan? Going after the legs? Why is he not going for the ultimate splash? Going for a suplex. He's got Jimmy Uso up. And a suplex. Down goes Jimmy Uso, but I, I don't get this game plan by the Warrior. Oh, wait a minute. He was just delaying it. Ultimate splash. One. Two. Oh, what? There is no way. Jimmy Uso just kicked out of a, another ultimate splash. And Uso is still fighting. But Warrior still reversing close line to the back. And that might have been it for Jimmy. No. No, it's not. Four by the Uso. Jimmy Uso is still in this. Oh, Warrior punches him. Side slam one more time. Oh, my God. The back has got to be killing Jimmy Uso right here. Oh. Um, see, ref, ref, totally not checking on his back, by the way. I'm just going to point that out there. <laughs> but it's got to be killing. Oh. Oh, Warrior. That's it. That, that's it. One, two, Ultimate Warrior advances. But damn, what a fight. Jimmy Uso brought it. That's the first Uso splash. And the second one, he did one more right after that. Right after the pitfall didn't work. Boom. Right there. My God, Jimmy Uso brought it. There's nothing to be ashamed about, but the Ultimate Warrior 
had that warrior spirit in him, which is why he was able to kick out of three Uso splashes. And Jimmy Uso and Sam was able to kick out of three Ultimate Warrior splashes, but then after that side slam and the back killing him, he couldn't take it anymore. No one in the match, the Ultimate Warrior. Ultimate Warrior picking up the victory. He is the fourth man in the Sweet 16. On the next video, guys, we will look to find four more people, four more competitors who will be in the Sweet 16, guys. This tournament is going to be wrapping up pretty, pretty damn fast. But I thank you guys for watching. What a hell, hell of a night that we just had. We will see you guys on the next one. Bang!